The stations in Tokyo are some of the busiest in the world, but the trains are among the most punctual. An average delay is only 18 seconds. Tokyo, Japan's capital, has the highest population of any city in the world, with over 35 million people. There's an amazing mix of the ultra-modern and technology, with more traditional beliefs and culture. You see this in everything, the buildings, the fashion, and even the food. This is very exciting. I'm at the Tsukiji Fish Market. This building has been here for 80 years or so, and you'll find the best seafood in the world. Obviously, as you know, the king of the water here is the tuna. Hundreds and hundreds of tuna get sold a day at some crazy price. So I'm here to get the best money can buy, which I'll take to a private lesson with the sushi master. This fish market is so clean. Everything is stunning. I can't be more fresh than this. Look at those clams. Oh, it's alive. <sighs> this place is crazy busy everywhere. You gotta be careful where you're going. Whoa. Way. This fish market is not only the busiest and largest in Tokyo, it's the biggest on the entire planet. I've been told to head to one of the oldest stalls here. The owner comes from a long line of fish sellers going back generations. So this shop is called Hicho, and Mr. Ida is the boss here. And he owns this place, and he knows everything about tuna. Look at the art of cutting it. If you make some mistakes, it costs a lot of money. This cuts of fish will be sent off in an hour or so to the best sushi chefs in Tokyo. It's quite incredible the way they wrap every individual pieces. They wrap it in the plastic and suck the air out so the oxygen doesn't change the color of the tuna. Look at it. Sucking the air out and then close it airtight. So hopefully I'm going to get some work experience there. I'm going to talk to the boss. You say that? Good morning. Hi. Yes. How are you? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is. Uh, I've been watching you. It's very, very impressive. Thank you. Chris. You get to from here and from anywhere else in the world? Sometimes uh, from Australia. Yes. Yes, in New Zealand. Tuna from Australia is good. Yes, good. Can you? Can I do something with you today, or? When I cut, I use this knife. Yes. It's a very small knife. Yeah. <laughs> Quite small. So you've got different knife for different jobs, yeah. Wow. Wow. So basically, the fish is that. So you go like this and yeah. underneath. Okay. Quite small. Yeah, it's. I can see. Yeah. Actually, this one is too soft. Too soft? I think I'm too soft too. Let me see. Yeah, it's bendy, isn't it? Mr. Ida is a wholesaler or tuna middleman. He buys a whole fish, then cuts it with precision to sell. And he's asked me to help. I know that tuna can be very, very expensive. How much is this one, for example? The whole fish, the 120 kilos. So that would be 120 kilos for one fish? Then the price is like 20,000 Australian dollars for one fish. 20,000 Australian dollars for one fish. You're kidding me. You want me to help you to cut this? All right. <laughs> 20,000, that's my whole budget for this trip around the world. Okay. 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 Aye. Wow. Can I try? OK. I'm eating a piece of fish that the whole fish costs $20,000. It's soft, smooth. You barely need to chew. It's very, very clean taste. I need to buy a small piece of Tuna for good quality sashimi. Sashimi for how many people? Just me. <laughs> but I, I, I'm a big boy, so I eat a lot. Be careful my fingers. <laughs> Look at that. Can I try to uh, 
to wrap it? Yes, sir. The one for me here. Uh, yes? Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> ah, a bit more? Yeah, that's enough. Is that enough? Yep. Okay. What's the price now? So, 1.3 kilos. Times six thousand yen. Quite cheap. Quite cheap. <laughs> I make a big discount. Right? Are you going to make me a discount? Yeah. Because I work for you. Wow. How good is that? Okay. Nine thousand yen. That's a deal. I give. I give you ten. Okay. Thank you. Okay. okay. Thank you. Domo arigato gozaimasu. Thank you so much. I don't think anyone can understand. I'm the happiest man on this planet right now. I'm going to a sushi master now after knowing uh, where the fish come from. He's gonna show me how to deal with it properly, cut it properly, and eat it properly. And that makes my day even better.